Okay, we are now going to visualize the DSIC results. So we will start by plotting the dispersion estimates. So we will say plot this ESTS. And then we will specify the DSIC objects. So we will say DDS. So let's run this command. Okay, so our plot has been generated. A typical dispersion plot will look like this. Let's go to the DSIC documentation page. This is how a typical dispersion plot will look like. And according to the DSIC documentation here, if you have a plot which is different from what is here, then it could be due to a number of factors. Okay, so the sample size, the number of coefficients, the row mean, and the variability of the genwise estimates all affect, or they can affect, or they influence the plots that will be generated. Okay, so with the plots, we are looking at the shrinkage. And so the amount of shrinkage can be more or less than seen here. Okay, so if what you have here is different, then you should consider investigating your data. So you can look into the sample size, number of coefficients, then these other factors that have been stated here. So this is what we have. If you compare the plots here with our plots, they are kind of similar. Okay, so this tells us that our data is okay. Well, according to, I mean, the dispersion plots that we have here. Okay, so that's what we have. So